Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Whatever time it is in your geographical location, you're welcome to the short word for today's audio daily devotion. Dear Lord, I know you are near and standing by my side. You guide and protect me from the known and unknown enemies, and you lead me in ways everlasting. Your hand is upon me, protecting me from evil and death, keeping me safe from harm. I just want to say thank you, Lord. Amen. Today is Friday, the 23rd of October, 2020, and the topic for the week is Overcoming Obstacles, Part 6 of 7, written by Jefferson Otombara Ingbi. The short word for today's quotation of the week is God is with me. The Bible verse for the week is taken from the book of Joshua chapter 1 verse 9, reading from the King James Version. Here is the Bible quotation. Have not I commanded thee, be strong and of good courage. Be not afraid, neither be thou dismayed. For the Lord thy God is with thee, whithersoever thou goest. End of Bible reading. The mind is a powerful force. I think it is the most powerful tool that humans have. It can be used to help you attain success or it can take you to the depths of failure. Once upon a time, God looked down from heaven and saw how the mind of the humans in the Tower of Babel was extraordinarily powerful. God said, the moment these people imagined anything, they will achieve their imagination. He is saying the same to you. Nothing can hinder your imagination. Nothing will restrain you from achieving whatever you have imagined. Your imagination is the key, not prayer. Your imagination is what gives your prayer a purpose. If you pray without imagination, your prayer will be inappropriate. No matter what advantages you have in life, there will always be difficulties and challenges. The key to overcoming them lies in your mind. You have the solution to any obstacle in your imagination. Use your imagination to solve any problem in your life. God wants you to use your mind and create the success you need in your endeavor. God cannot make you successful. You heard me. I am not blaspheming. You meditate your way into success. It is written in the scripture. Here is a Bible quote. Joshua chapter 1 verse 8. Reading from the King James Version. This book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day and night, that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous, and then thou shalt have good success. End of Bible reading. The word of God should not depart out of your mouth. You read, study, and meditate the word. Reading the word breeds knowledge. Studying the word breeds understanding. And meditating the word breeds wisdom. You can see, with knowledge, understanding, and wisdom, you have created a powerful tool that will enhance the power of your imagination. The mind is the key to success. Until you become the master of your mind, you cannot be the master of anything. Your life is a creation of your mind. Your mind is precious. It has the power to unlock infinite possibilities. This is the end of part 6 of the Sure Word audio devotion series titled Overcoming Obstacles.